So the fastest way to get your vibe coding into complete hallucination mode is to change models mid-conversation. Now I do this a lot and sometimes it works, but other times it just goes completely off the rail. So in this case, I was using Haiku. It was trying to solve a problem and it definitely was not getting the problem right. But because I'm running out of Opus tokens, I switched over to Sonnet and it went straight into full hallucination mode. It didn't even know what program we were actually working on. And it kept saying it fixed it and just hit refresh. And I kept saying it wasn't fixing it. And in reality, in the end, it wasn't even working on the same program I was working on. It was working on some old version that we had abandoned earlier before we changed the directory structure. So it was all because I switched models mid-conversation in order to do some debugging. What I should have done is switched models, exited Claude, came back in, asked it to review its progress, and then continued debugging. Now, vibe coding is getting more and more interesting, but you have to be willing to work around the issues that it has. It's come a long way, but it's definitely not where it needs to be. So just keep Keep coming up with the techniques that you need to use to get by and don't count on the models to know things and definitely don't anthropomorphize them where you think they're actually human. They're definitely not human. Humans do not have the sketchy kind of memory uh, and the uh, attention to detail sometimes that these uh, LLMs have.